What's poppin' yo, it's the ape in the flesh, don't pee. Bringing you another Call of Duty game, playing on the new map, V2. <clears throat> nice, 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 nice. Nice. Nice gameplay right here for you guys, man. Straight up from the ape in the flesh. Don't pee. But guys, man, I got some news from my friends at Charlie Intel. Uh, some World War II news about the next DLC coming out, DLC number three. So we're going to jump right into it. Let me get my notes. Thunder voice. We say <clears throat> the next DLC we said it says that we're gonna have 13 new weapons. Uh, so now the DLC maps says that we might have some locations in Africa somewhere. And what I'm the I'm most excited about, <laughs> believe it or not, is face paint. Now <laughs> There's not much detail about the face paint and how it's gonna be, but man, this is this is crazy, bro. I, I'm telling you, this is crazy. But hold on, hold on, hold on. Your boy's about to go. Hold on, hold on. Para para pim pam, para para pim pam pim pam pim, para para pam 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 pim. Anyway, <clears throat> we got 13 new weapons for DLC for, uh, number three. And I don't know, man. Uh, there's a lot of weapons. Personally, I don't think that every single one of these weapons will make it to the to the to the to the, to the DLC. Um, they say that it, it reads here that um, we're gonna have a sword. Now I see that going through the sword. Uh, the other weapons, I'm not even gonna look into them. Um, because it's just not um they change the stats and whatever you know and some weapons are supposed to be uh ars they make them lngs and vice versa so i'm not going to really go into each weapon but the interesting thing is the sword that they're going to have this sword coming out also another another piece of news here is that they're going to have a new commando division now, uh, this division is very complex, man. Very, very difficult. Very, uh, very different from the rest of the divisions. Since every single um, training in this division um, increases by the number of kills that you get within the division. Um, uh, it's very complicated. For example, in the 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 specialist uh, basic training for this um, for this uh, division, he says three tiers of basic tra training are water after the required amount of kills. Unknown if player choose chosen or present basic tra training. Now it says increase explosive damage resistance per crouch prone kill. Uh, you know that's that's crazy, man. Like you have to be in order for this to activate, you have to be crouch or prone, uh, and then it go by percentage or whatever. I mean, it's very difficult. You could go check it out. Um, also, uh, they say they're gonna have. Um, Chrome Tiger Camel. That's another news piece of news, and they're also gonna have um, uh, um, um, one of the maps supposed to be in North Africa, a place called uh, to to Tunisia. So that's very interesting, man. Um, I'm I, I'll tell you something, man. If 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 you're not playing this game, uh, you're missing out. Cause this game is getting better. Uh, they doing a lot of improvement to it, but we're gonna I mean, look at that. Panama, Panama. We're gonna jump into the second half real quick and continue talking about this update. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ah. 
second <clears throat> second second uh, half of the game. Uh, boys going in. You guys check the score, bro. Did you did you look at the score? Man, we we raping these kids, man. It's crazy. Anyway, um, face camels, man. I wonder. He says face paints have been referred to in Call of Duty World War II game files following the latest patch. There are some mentions of it in the files, but no other information has been revealed thus far. Now, <clears throat> interesting, man. Face camels. Are we going to get camels like Black Ops? Or is it something that we can actually customize like we do with the weapons? I, I'm telling you something, man. I, I mean, I, I've i been wanting face camels for a long time. I think that one of the... The neat things about Black Ops is the face camels. But I've been wanting to have face camels for the long, long, longest time, man. And I, I wonder, man, like, it sounds to me that it's kind of going to be kind of like Black Ops. But I wish it would be something that we can customize, like the face paint. But now that it says, like, you know, face camels, it looks like it most likely be like a regular camel, like on Black Ops. But you know, I wish that we could have face paint where you can customize the face paint on your character. That would be kind of neat, man. Um, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think that one thing about Call of Duty, I get sip on my drinky drink here. One thing that I always say about Call of Duty is that Call of Duty, um, fall behind times when it comes to customizing. I don't know what the hell is going on with my video, bro. Really don't. It's, I've been having some issues with my technology here, man. Uh, they've been they be falling behind, man, on, 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 on some things, man, uh, in customization. You know what I'm saying? Like, like for many years, you were able to create your own character in games like 2K, uh, 2K basketball and and the wrestling games and and the and the uh, the fight night games you know you're able to customize your character and make it look like you or make it look like whatever and this game you know they they don't even make it where you can customize some face paint you know and and, and I don't understand why not you know some people say nah because people you know they'll be doing some man people be doing some racist offensive stuff with the with the uh, titles and stuff like that and and so i don't want to hear that man I, it's time for us to have a little bit of more freedom when it comes to customizations to the face of the character man so that way not everybody lose the same like like I, I, you know what i'm saying like nobody cares i like i don't care about you pink fruity pebble looking gun you know what i'm saying i want to see like i would like to see some customization in the in the character face so people dif differentiate between each other man so not everybody looks the same man I, I you know i apologize for this badass horrible video uh whatever is going on with my video man this is embarrassing but anyway Nobody cares about that, man. I would love to see some face paint, something that you can customize, that you can make it your own. You know what I'm saying? It would be kind of neat, man. And and, and and I don't understand why Call of Duty doesn't do that. You know, like the franchise, like Activision, like why they don't, they don't go that route. You know what I'm saying? Instead, they decide to go with like this weird... Uh, copy like game crap you know what i'm saying i don't know man but anyway are you excited about these updates man i'm very excited man ever since this new guy came into play and making executive the uh, 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 uh executive decisions towards this game man the game has improved dramatically and i and i'm liking it i'm i'm falling in love with this game once again and so far in my opinion this is the best game slash hammer have made so far. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video. Share the video if you like the video. And to the next time. This is your boy Don't Be signing out. Salute. Ooh, ooh, ah, ooh, ooh.